Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, have I missed doing YouTube videos. So I thought I'd bring it back with a makeup video. Today I wanted to do a glam makeup look because I'm going out tonight. So this is quite a full on look for me. I sort of experimented with some new things. Yeah, I really love it. So I really hope you enjoy this video. Just keep watching. So I've primed my face and done my foundation. I used the Rimmel Fix Perfect Primer and I then followed this with the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. Both of these are my go-to. I really try not to use anything else. Plus I've broken out at the moment and this is a really full coverage foundation that you just that just works. It's so good. And then going to follow with Rimmel Anti-Aging Concealer. I am going to go in with another concealer, which is the Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer. Now that my concealer is all blended, I'm going to use my Airspun Loose Face Powder and that is in the shade Naturally Neutral. I do sort of pat it all over my face because I don't want to rub off the concealer. So to bronze, I'm going to use my Bobbi Brown Bronzing Powder in the shade Neutral. Natural? In the shade Natural. Whoops. <laughs> Just a couple of taps in there. I always start with the cheekbone just because I'm there's the most powder on the brush at that point and that's where I want to get the contour anyway. I always make sure to do down my neck as well because makeup lines are not the one. So to contour a little bit more, because I like to exaggerate it a little bit, I am going to use the same bronzer, just so it's easier really. So I'm going to use the Pure Colour Envy Sculpting Blush Palette from Estee Lauder. Oh! Wow, I dropped it. I did break something. Oh, I uh, messed up my blusher. Okay, so I'm just gonna go in again into the cheekbones and just continue to contour. I then actually use the brush that comes in the palette, I mean, who does that, to um, highlight my cheekbones a little bit. And the bridge of my nose again. Top of my lip. So next I'm going to use my blusher that I've just broken. Well not broken but uh, sort of dug a hole in it. <laughs> the peachier colour. Oh and this blush palette is from e.l.f. and I've switched out certain things so it's a mess. And because I'm going for a golden sort of look today, a goldeny brown sort of look, um, I'm using my Makeup Revolution highlighter palette. So I'm going to use Flaxen just to highlight my cheekbones. So moving on to my eyes, I'm using the same highlighter, Flaxen, to go into the corners of my eyes. Excuse the uh, facial expressions, I literally I can't not pull them. <laughs> it's gonna go below my eyebrow and over my eyelid as well. I'm just plastering it all over my eye, let's be real. So I'm gonna go back in with the, the Bobbi Brown bronzer and actually put that on my eyes. I 
I'm bringing the bronzer really under the eye as well. So I want to make my eyes a little bit darker, so I'm going to go in with my Collection Nude Eyes Uncovered palette, which is super old actually. It's got a darker gold shade in it, which I really want to use, so... And now I'm going to go in with my Blaze highlighter, this one here. I never thought these actually worked, but they actually do, and I now love them. I'm going in with my Extreme Black Estee Lauder Mascara, which is really good, and it makes your eyelashes look really long. Okay, so my lashes are done, but I am gonna add false lashes now as well. I just like to put my mascara on first because I feel like it holds up the lashes and helps them form a bit better. I basically get these from Savers and you can, they're £3.50 for four lashes and they are awesome lashes, they're so good. They are Eileen lashes. I'm also using my eyelash glue from Eyelure. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Eyelure. This is literally the best eyelash glue I've used. My lashes stay on and it actually hurts to peel it off. In my eyes that's a good thing so I don't want them coming off. <laughs> so I just pop a bit of glue on the lashes and I just wait for that to get a bit sticky. Yep, so the glue is not dry yet. Okay, one lash done. Blue Waterproof Eyeliner. It's from Bourjois. Is that how you say it? I don't know. Yeah, and basically because I have blue eyes, I want to accentuate that. So I'm going to just put that on my waterline. I just want to dry it first though. If anyone's a bit squeamish about eyes, don't look at me doing this. So I don't know if you can see the difference. I think it's quite nice quite different you know okay so that's the blue eyeliner done so for my eyebrows I'll just be using my spoolie thingy which I got off of eBay for like two quid so I'm just gonna brush out my my eyebrows I'm gonna use my eyebrow pencil just to pencil in brush as if it's like hairs, if you get what I mean. So that's my brows done. So now I'm just gonna do my lips. I'm gonna go for the L'Oreal liner contour for lip. I'm just line my lips. And to go with the lip liner is the matching lipstick. Number 630, beige anew. Beige anew, that's the colour. So the lip liner and the lipstick match. And they both smell like palmer violets. I just think that's amazing. And just to finish off, Estee Lauder in the shade Envy. So I will be back to you when my hair is done. makeup video I really hope you enjoyed it please like this video if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I'll see you in the next one bye